What is up you guys? This is El Gato and today what I want to talk to you guys about well before I get to that let me right now you're as you can see watching some game some Mortal Kombat gameplay this is a let's play video we're playing uh, what? Mortal Kombat but but today's topic though what I want to talk to you guys about was um, do you store which kind of stores enforce the ESRB rating? Like, the reason why I'm talk I want to talk about this topic is because I want to go buy this game. I was at I was in Target, and usually, like, usually when I go to a store like Best Buy or something, I can just probably pick like a. I can pro I can just pick um like a rated M game and buy it but this time though it's, instead of that they, they had me they wanted me to scan some sort of ID I'll let someone scan my driver's license and pop it, that something popped up on their screen saying that I was too young I'm, I'm 16 you guys by the way and I was surprised. I was thinking, there is smoke, there huh? Is fire. I've never been at. Every time I bought a game, I've rated M17 Plus game. I never really been. I never really been asked like, um, to actually have to actually be 17 and purchase the game. So I, I don't know how to. I don't. I don't know what to say. So I. I just told my. Well, it's a good thing my dad was there with me. So. He bu I let him buy it and I just paid him back, but I was kind of, but that day I was surprised, I'm like, I'm thinking, what the heck, I've never been to a store that actually enforced the ESRB rating. So, something new. Like, I'm pretty sure if you guys, um, I'm not sure if it's happened to you guys was, um, where you guys live, if they actually ask you for an ID to, so they can say you're 17. I mean, it's a good idea that they do enforce it, and I, I like it. It makes it better so like little kids don't go in there buying games that they don't need, that they shouldn't be playing. But at the same time, though, it's like I don't know. I just never really exper experienced that before, where they had have actually asking for an ID to pay for a 17 game. Finish this. And that's kind of. Pretty much all I want to talk to you guys about because I never went through that so far. Th th my whole time I've been here, um, well, I I've been buying like M games and they've never. I've never one time been asked to for my ID except for in Target. It's kind of weird because I remember going to Target and buying a game there. I do like well, maybe my dad did, but. I just never actually had someone ask me that. Ask me that, so that's so yeah. That's pretty much what I wanted to talk to you guys about. I'll just do I guess, I'll do one more fight before I end the video. So hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of this Police video. Coming up. Round one. Fight. <laughs> That would look like it really hurt. Round two, fight. What the hell? <laughs> A flashlight? Oh, dang. Busted. Busted. I'm busted. All right. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, he's jumping. Look at this jumper. Dang. Oh, oh, nope. Nope, nope. Let's see if I remember how to do that. Aw, oh, damn it. Nope. I won. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the rest of this video. And please leave a like if you like if you liked it as always. And I thank you guys for watching. You guys have a, g a great day.